got a call from the IRS, and uh, they said that they were going to file a lawsuit against us. So they left a number, which was 202-213-4376. And um, so we're going to be calling them up to, to find out about that. Don't want to get in trouble with the IRS. Um, yes, I got a phone call from this number saying that I was going to have a lawsuit filed against me. What am I uh, My name is Jason Freeman. Jason, okay. And what's your address? My address is 3221 71st Avenue in Kelso, Washington. Nine eight six three two. Nine eight six three two, right? Yes. And how you spell your last name, Jason? F R E E M A N. Okay. Yeah. Mr. Freeman? Yes. First of all, Mr. Freeman, you are speaking with Frank Anderson and my extension is 554041. You can note down that. Okay. given from me to the IRS, it most certainly would have been on purpose. What do you mean by that? Well, I mean taxation is theft, and so I don't really, you know, let just outside forces take my stuff. But I didn't know it was going to result in an arrest warrant for me. What do you want to do? You want to resolve this situation outside the courthouse, or you want to take this case inside the courthouse? Well, how do we uh, resolve it outside of courthouse? And which courthouse? Outside the courthouse, then why you want to know the courthouse name, sir? You are resolving this outside the courthouse. I'm just kind of panicking here because I don't want to go to jail. Okay. For resolving this situation outside the courthouse, you, have, you need to clear your pending amount, which is 5000 Oh yeah. To verify to get. I got loads of money that I don't report to the IRS. I do have this amount. Oh yes, I definitely have this amount. Jason Freeman is a rich man. Yeah, where do you have this amount? What amount? I have it in my bank account. I want you to go drive to our city. Notify me when you're inside your car. You have to go to your bank. 
Okay, I have my bank card out. I want you to go to a server and withdraw this amount in cash. Okay, so I need to tell you how much is in my bank account, the amount in cash? Oh, you have to withdraw this amount in cash. So you have to go to a server bank for doing the transaction to the headquarters of the IRS. So I want you to leave mm -hmm. out and notify me when you have your car. I will let you know where you have to go. Okay. Well, I'm like, if I just have to go to an ATM, there's an ATM right across the street. Yeah. You need me to go get like $6,000 in cash out of the ATM? Yes, sir. Yes, I Okay. Um, what do I do with it once I have it? Okay, hold on just a sec. Okay. Okay, I'm sticking my card in the machine right now. Hold on just a sec. Yes, I'm sure. Give me my money. Okay, I have $6,000 cash on me right now. Yep. ATM is at your house or what? No, I have an ATM right across the street. Mm -hmm. Okay, do you have a credit card? I do. So write me a credit card number. The credit card number is zero two three one. Two, four, nine, three, three, two, six, four, four, six, eight, nine. What's the pin? It's a three, one, one, two. Repeat it. Yeah, repeat your credit card number. Well, I mean, like, how much are you? I I just took all the money out of that account, so I don't know how much good the the credit card number is going to do you. That seems kind of odd. No, 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 no. No, I want you to repeat your credit card number. Repeat that. Okay. What if I don't feel comfortable repeating it? Well, I, I, I don't like giving money to the IRS, and that's why I don't ever report anything to it, so... That's, that's kind of... I'm not... Yeah. I mean, it looks like I'm caught in a rock in a hard place here, so what should I do? Just shake my dick? Like, um, okay. Like, don't, um, how am I gonna get you the money? <laughs> so, do you actually get money out of people, like, doing this? Like, do you convince people to give you money? Because, um, you know, the IRS can come and suck my fucking dick any time of the day. Like, even if you were really the IRS, I would give you the same reaction because I'm a liberty activist and taxation is theft and I would never give you guys my money willingly in the first place, especially if you made a call. Like, if I had some IRS agent call me, I would just more than likely request to know what color of panty she's wearing, and then I'd order a sandwich. What do you think of that? Uh, I think about it. I'm going to hang out this call. Why? I'm just going to call back forever and ever and ever. I'm going to block your number. I'm going to give your number to everybody on the internet, because I've been recording this whole thing, and it's going up on my YouTube channel. What do you think of that? You're going to leave this job. How about I just send all your information to, like, uh, ICE, Trump's stupid-ass ICE program that I usually call and tell them about illegal aliens such as, like, Canadian geese that are getting in my way down at the lake. But I can call them about you guys because 
highly doubt that you have the proper paperwork, which I don't even actually believe that people should have paperwork from the government to cross borders and do jobs, but when you're defrauding people, that's definitely a bad thing. Hello, Ahmed. You there? I'm going to leave this job.